Hello everyone, welcome to another Funko Pop unboxing video. Today I'll be unboxing the flocked version of Bob Ross. Now you're probably saying, they made a flocked version of Bob Ross. I didn't know this was a thing. What's that sticker? What was it exclusive to? Why did I not hear about it? Well, here's the thing. Um, if you remember, a couple weeks ago, I unboxed Bob Ross here in all his glory, the regular version. I did this for my 3,000th uh, subscriber special video. You know, I kind of acted like him. I had my backdrop, changed a bunch of paint products and stuff like that. Paint brushes, paint palette, uh, stuff like that. It was a fun little video I did, because I figured Funko was just going to make one Bob Ross. So I said, when I unbox him, I'll just make that a special video um, for my 3,000 subscriber milestone. But... Funko, <laughs> literally a couple days after I shot that video, decided to announce they are going to make four more, actually this is five, five more Bob Ross Pops. There's going to be a Bob Ross with a giant paintbrush, you know, that he used his, in his intros for the television show, uh, The Joy of Painting. There's going to be a Bob Ross with a raccoon, a uh, Bob Ross with a squirrel, and Bob Ross with an owl. As you, if you remember, if you watch the show, he used to have animals on the show all the time. And each of those three are holding paintings, so he's gonna also be holding paintings. That's four. And then this one was a big surprise because they didn't even really announce this one. So this makes five. There's gonna be a total of six Bob Ross pops. I already have the regular one as I showed you, but that makes six. Um, so uh, yeah, I can't make a video, you know, like that again where I'm. You know, talk, talking like this, this is Bob Ross. This is the flocked version of Bob Ross from The Joy of Painting. Um, <laughs> that will kind of defeat the purpose of it being a special video. So, unfortunately, whenever I get those pops, I already pre-ordered them, by the way. I can't pre-order the, uh, which, one of them is exclusive to Target. I think it's the one with the raccoon. Um, I can't pre-order that one yet, because Target hasn't posted it on their website yet. But all the other ones I pre-ordered. Um, and one of them's a Chase version, too, but I found a bundle online that had it. So, I'm getting all of them, don't worry, because, you know, I do love Bob Ross and his show and stuff like that. I'm a big fan. Um, now, anyways, <laughs> you're probably wondering, what exactly is this exclusive to? Big G Creative, as you can see in the title. Uh, if you don't know what Big G Creative is, it's basically this company that makes board games. And there's actually a board game based off Bob Ross and his television show. It's called Bob Ross, The Art of Chill. I think that's the name of it. It's a little board game that comes with like paint and stuff like that and all these little accessories. Um, and they decided to go ahead and sell that board game on Target's website with this included. It was like a bundle. You get the board game and this pop that's flocked. Um, just the hair and the goatee, obviously, or, or should I say the beard, not a goatee. Yeah, it's a full on beard or flocked, not the rest of him, obviously. But anyways, um, <laughs> Target had an exclusive where you buy the board game and you get this with it. Now, for some reason, that sold out way too fast. I was not able to purchase it. So I went ahead and went on eBay and bought this from a seller just to pop alone. I really didn't want the board game, to be honest. So I'm kind of glad Target, you know, ran out of or was out of stock of it. Because I would have ended up buying the board game and regretting it. Because I'm like, oh, why would I pay so much for the board game if I don't want it? Uh, I just want the pop. <laughs> so I bought this off a of seller off eBay for a decent price. So thankfully, I did not have to buy that board game. But yeah, Big G Creative exclusive. Technically a Target exclusive because that was the only place that sold it. But uh, yeah. Now that I'm done rambling, let's get this opened up and take a look at Bob Ross. And he's going right back in the box because I do not leave my flock pops out. My room gets very dusty and dust can ruin the flocked uh, versions of characters. So they did a pretty good job on this one, I think. It's kind of a little messy up here, but it's not always perfect. It's funny that they did this. A lot of people were like wondering, why didn't you make Bob Ross flocked? Well, guess what? They did. So they got some titanium quite, <laughs> some sap green, uh, some phthalo blue, crimson red. Let's see if I can remember all the colors. Van Dyke brown, um... Cad Yellow, I think, is the name? I don't even know. Um, I was watching a lot of Bob Ross videos uh, last month. Um, falling asleep to Bob Ross videos and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, this is very, very similar to the regular one, obviously. It's just the same pop. They just flocked the hair. Um, yeah, it's literally the same paint and everything like that. So, yeah, that is the flocked version of Bob Ross right there. I definitely prefer this one, but he's going to have to stay in the box. 
Uh, so yeah, stay tuned, and I think December is when they come out. The other four Bob Ross Pops, the one with the paintbrush, the one with the raccoon, the one with the owl, and the one with the squirrel. And one of those three is a chase version, but I have pre-ordered them all, except for the Target one, which I think is the raccoon. I don't even know, but when, I come, when it comes up for pre-order, I will pre-order it. Anyways, thanks for watching this, and have a fantastic evening. God bless.